Ghosties, oh my, Halloween is right around the corner, and if you're looking for a good scare, you've got to come and check out Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights. What are you guys looking forward to seeing tonight? Everything. I'm just excited to see to see the, the experience of what we've been making, working on so hard with the whole cast and Robert from like an outside perspective. So I want to see, I want to see other people go through and experience what we did while we're making the show. We were fans of the film going into working on the show and then DJ and I got to step into that iconic set and see it for ourselves. And now fans of the show are gonna get to step in and see, gotcha. see the set after hopefully watching the series, so. And you guys are gonna be like, wow, that was really scary and terrifying. We didn't know that from being on set, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah well. But, I mean, set had its moments too. I mean, oh, okay. Greg Nicotero, who's obviously very, very well known for all of his amazing work uh -huh. he's been doing, is uh, he's on our show as well, and he does all of our creatures and special effects. So, cool. you never know what you're gonna get on set. There's a lot of times we walk on and get get spooked. <laughs> what are you guys gonna be for Halloween this year? Do you guys know yet? We don't know, but we're lazy. So okay. I'm imagining we're just gonna switch characters. I'll, he'll give me his glasses, and then we'll just switch characters. Done. Can you guys give some advice for all the ladies out there looking to find the perfect Halloween costume? What are some of the do's and don'ts. Okay, I have a thing about this. Okay. It's lazy. Everything you see is like, they do like slutty firemen. Okay. It like, it like there's a lot of girl outfits that are really skimpy. It's just like a right. basic thing, but they have like mini skirts. Right. It's like missing a chunk not, of fabric. I'm not. I'm not against that. Okay. I'm just saying, you know, don't don't. That's too easy. Think of something. Go a little. Think a little bit harder. Try something and find with some, a gown. Something with a <laughs> something creative. Yeah. Something 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 interesting. We're gonna play a really quick game to test your knowledge in horror films. Oh, wow. Are you ready? Probably. I don't know. We'll find out. Okay. The pressure is on. But the good news is it's all multiple choice. So. Great. Great. <laughs> Number one. Which character killed people in their dreams? A. Michael Myers. B. Freddy Krueger. Freddy or. Krueger. Freddy Krueger. Perfect. Number two. In what movie, if you watch a videotape, you'll die in seven days? A, wrong turn, B, the ring, or C, the grudge? The ring. The ring. Wow, guys, I'm impressed, okay. All right, number three, which horror film was the first to get nominated for Best Picture Oscar? A, Rosemary's Baby, B, Silence of the Lamb. Wrong, C, C. The Exorcist. Oh, the Exorcist, shit, really? Okay, all right. <laughs> you guys are a little really? An Oscar? Baby did get wow. nominated as well, right? After okay. The Exorcist, yep. Yeah. Real Another, okay. I would've got that wrong. Okay. Which horror film has the highest body count? A, Dawn of the Dead, B, Carrie, or C, Ghost Chip? I haven't seen any of them, but I think Dawn of the Dead Dawn is like a zombie Dawn killer, so I'd say Dawn of the Dead. Dawn of the Dead. You guys are good. Three out of four, high five. Okay. Amazing. Well, I mean, technically, I still kind of got that other one right. I just didn't hear the last right, answer. Right, you did. We'll give it to you out of technicality. Have fun tonight. Thank you. Yeah.